It was a very special day at Galvez Primary in Prairieville. We're back on our campus. I'm so excited. And whose two class are you in? Miss Bursa days. Is it going to be a great day? Yes. Buses delivered kids. Parents did too. This was the first time they actually wanted to wake up and go to school because they're back in their new school. So it, we're back, we're getting back to normal. I'm liking it. It's good. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Norman Rockwell would have loved this little piece of Americana. Mrs. Grimble's second grade pirates are once again learning the three R's. Sorry. It is homecoming. Tell me your thoughts and feelings about today. This is very exciting. Uh, Aiden. I was kind of nervous because it's like new. If we would have went back to Lakeside, I would have popped my top. I saw the sign on the, on the gate and it, welcome home pirates and it was like, oh, that got me, choked me up. And on her birthday too. It's really a whole new temporary school built right behind the damaged permanent facility that's been fenced off and is set to be repaired later on. They're so excited. They just, they're waiting to see all the new classrooms. They're excited to see the new cafeteria. Uh, they don't even know we have a library yet, so they'll be excited when they get into that. Uh, some of the kids in, even indicated that they had uh, water in their eyes because they were happy to be back on this campus. And so it was tears of joy. Out front, the Galvez primary sign hasn't changed since last August. The keys lost in the flood. It's a gentle reminder of where they were and just how far they've come. In Prairieville, Heath Allen, WDSU News.